Hi, I'm Luke Haynes. I'm here at uh, Fall Paducah Quilt Week, and these are my quilts. Uh, it's all a show of log cabins. I've made 50 iterations on this traditional quilt block, all made out of used clothing. So every one of them has the same dimensions and the same kind of material. So it's about iteration within it. So I'm coming from a graphic design and architecture background, bringing that to quilting. So my idea here is to work through this traditional pattern and understand some of the graphic implications and some of the technical uh, changes that happen with making small shifts in the quilts. So my inspiration for this show comes from uh, my background is an architect, so I really like to work through iteration and construction, uh, but not really understanding as much about quilting yet. So I'm wanting to learn, though I've been a quilter for 10 years, more about quilting as a history of technique and sort of visual design. So I'm working on changing small things about one quilt block uh, and arranging them in different ways so that I can understand sort of the visual notational system that has come for hundreds and hundreds, thousands of years before me that, that I'm trying to pick up and learn and bring into my work. So this show is about my understanding of use of material and this iteration within simple changes in the most traditional, the most basic repeatable quilt block unit. So as part of this exhibition, we've hung them so that we can see both the front and the back because the, the purpose of this show in presentation is to kind of illustrate the fact that quilts are sculptural objects and I think it's important to be able to see the front and the back and navigate them in sort of a three-dimensional space because they actually hold a history of utility unlike a painting which is designed only for the wall. Quilts can be aesthetic and uh, interesting visually, but they also hold a, a history of utility. So uh, understanding them as three-dimensional objects is really important for me and my practice. So all 40 of these quilts that we're displaying here are, are displayed in a way that we can navigate all sides of it, kind of like the, their sculpture, which I think is important to show. And thanks for coming. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. See you at next Quilt Week.